Act. Thanks again for joining us on Lake Tahoe this week. I'm Curtis Fong, the guy from Tahoe, and we are very pleased to have from Harris Lake Tahoe, the show La Cumba, Jorge Bermudez, the percussionist, the conga player. He is joining us this week. Thanks for coming by. Thank Look you at this colorful me. outfit. Man, you are like, you are the man. What is happening? Well, huh? ever since I watched uh, Ricky Ricardo and I Love Lucy as a kid, <laughs> I always wanted a shirt like this. That's the only reason I'm doing the show, because I get to wear this shirt. <laughs> That's great. Well, what's it like being in La Cumba? Huh? It's a very different experience for some of the things that I've done in my career because um, I've never been the centerpiece to all this great choreography that's going on. Of course, la cumba, what it means is rumba, salsa, samba, tango, yeah. pachanga, la cumba. Wow. <laughs> la, cumba, la cumba is a rhythm from South Africa, but you got to remember there was a marriage, African slaves to the Caribbean. And that's what we're trying to do for you guys. So it's a fun show. Yeah. Very fun. Now, your career, you talked about a career. You've been doing, uh, geez, a percussion for some notable artists, uh, such as Jose Feliciano, Pablo Cruz. Tell us about some of the other folks you've uh, worked with. Well, probably the most notable uh, career achievement that I, that I always feel good about is Crowded House, Don't Dream oh, yeah. It's Over. Anytime I'm in the supermarket and I hear that, song play i feel like yelling and going hey man i'm on that song <laughs> that's your song <laughs> we have that album here right here too and uh, this is the crowded house uh, that take here and we'll uh, show that a little bit later so uh, you were on that tape yes all right so uh, i've toured with uh, uh, many artists um but i guess the most exciting things going on there's a film called birdcage that some of you might have caught that's right with robin williams and i did the percussion throughout that so that was a lot of fun and very much one of the funniest films. I've done a lot of films work in LA, but that was fun because, you know, Robin Williams and, and Nathan Lane, I believe his name is, yeah. they're really funny. Yeah, there's a track to crazy so, people there. <laughs> so uh, the musicians that were working on the recording, we constantly had to go s stop the take because we'd be laughing to what we were recording to, right? Yeah. <laughs> all right. Now, also, I understand you've been working on a project uh, that we're all going to hear. The whole world will hear. Myself and the percussionist from Santana and Mickey Hart of the Grateful Dead, during the opening ceremonies of the Olympics, you're going to hear this bombastic percussion score that Philip Glass is going to score over. And uh, very exciting. It took four days to do, and we hunkered down up in, at the Grateful Dead Ranch, and it's going to be. Wow, so this massive. is the, the big intro, the, the music track of. When the... everybody marches in, yes, all the countries. Wow, you got to be proud to be a uh, part of that, huh? It, it, it's very much a feel-good experience. I don't think my playing has ever had that kind of exposure. Wow. Well, we're going to definitely tune in to the Olympics and catch that there. Anything else going on in your life? Uh, where do you go from here? Well, La Cumba is what, where we're going to be till about August, and we've got a real nice cast. I want to take just a quick second to acknowledge one of the other talents. Mm -hmm in the company. This is David Wright's production, of course, and Nanine Bergman is a very talented lady. She's a singer, and you'll be hearing from her in, in the years to come. Remember that name, Nanine Bergman. Nanine She's been around. Bergman. She's from Sacramento. Okay. And, uh, of course, uh, Tiger Martina's choreography and David Wright's production, and I'm really pleased that Harris is doing a tropical production and that they invited me on board to, to take part in it. Well, I understand you're a pretty uh, integral part of the program up there. You and can't miss me. I <laughs> can't miss you. Now, um, the, the times that the shows play uh, nightly? 7.30 and 10.30. But on the nights uh, that we have the artists, we just do a midnight show like we did this weekend with Sheena Easton. Oh, that's right. Sheena Easton was in. How'd she do? She did. did you have a great show? She was sounding good. Yeah? She was sounding good. The, uh, the percussionist I was playing with her, I uh, hadn't seen him in years. We did a Jeffrey Osborne record. Oh, wow. Ten years ago, uh, which was a, a fun kick to run into him. Well, I see that. You've also recorded with Johnny Mathis, Curtis Blow, Rod Stewart. Uh, who else? I guess uh, one more thing that we, we can mention, you know, as far as I've always been a fan of Santana's. My friend Raul Rico has been the conga player since 76, and we have a running gag that he runs into people that say they've played with Santana, but they really haven't. I did. We just did a home video. We, we brought in a percussion dance troupe. And it was an all-star cast of John Lee Hooker, Bob Weir, and we just did that in February. Wow. Exciting. Well, why don't you uh, give us some beats here? Oh, yeah, man. 
Muévate, bailen en la calle con el coro de tambores. Óyeme, muévate, la rumba, la rumba, la rumba de Bermúdez. ¡Ja! When we come back, we're going to tell you about some of the other recreation coming up, so don't go.